Sorry, it's November here. And I have been told multiple times to, uh, in this time of the year, to check your cameras frequently. So we check our cameras. And especially if Carson gets one day a week, maybe, to hunt, my job is, is to figure out where these shooters are at and uh, make sure he's at least in the right area. So we're going to check a couple cameras here and uh, see what's moving around the farm. It's just that constant reminder of a much bigger picture. Welcome to my rodeo. Uh, 60 degrees. I think it's coldest day of the year so far. It actually feels like fall. And uh, last time I was out, I was self filming, which was a debacle. But Kyle's here today, so it should be nice. Heading over to the other farm in search of Freak. I think Kyle and I were there I don't know, about four or five weeks ago and had a good hunt. but. Got another picture of Freak just a couple nights ago out on this food plot. Thing looks like an absolute dinosaur. He's at least five and a half years old. I mean, he's not real pretty up top. He's a freak, but hopefully see him tonight. I feel like Groundhog Day because we hunt this spot a lot, but this is a spot when we got pictures of Freak in July that we were like, this is the spot we gotta be often. Cause this deer is just so cool, so big, so unique. We'll see, it's cool, 60 degrees, the weather seems right. Surrounded by does all night, but Another buck just entered the field. Son, what are we going to do? Go on a four wheeler ride. No, we're not going on a four wheeler ride. We're going. Uh huh. What are we going to try to find? A deer. A, what kind of deer? I don't know. Pink one. A big one. A big one. A really, really big one. A really, really, really big one. Mm -hmm. Can you put that in the bag? <gasps> There's a deer on here. That's right. Can we put it in the bag? Back out, still firearm season this week. Decided to uh, do something a little crazy. Brought the little one out here this evening. Brought something with me. When we've been working this spot on the farm, cutting corn, she's loved this box blind. She just wants to come and hang out. It's like a tree fort, so. Figured tonight's as good as night ever to bring her with me, so she's my co-pilot. Hunting Showtime 2.0, as the deer we're still after. Um, We'll see, excited to be out here. A little bit of snowflakes falling, about 35 degrees. And uh, we'll see if this is the destination. Do you see them? Do you see them? Do you see the deer, honey? Are you excited? Do you want to sit on your chair? Are you excited? I don't want to take them. Side of the ditch over there. Look like a good buck. 
That's that spot where I put that camera. It's all those scrapes. How do I get him over here, Kyle? Yeah, I was in Strata Grand Adam. You Grand Adam. You see him over there? Back out here over our food plot, the rut is on, and uh, this farm they just harvested all the corn in this field and trying something new this year. We're gonna pick about a third of an acre here and just mow about a third acre of the standing corn and keep tucking the blind into it. But really, the goal is just to have a sustainable source of food all year for these deer. You know, this time of year we need some consistency so these does keep funneling out here, and then hopefully our guys, uh, freak or ghost, show up right behind them. So do it. Stumbled into some good news a few days ago. Ghost is still alive. Deer I hit top of the front shoulder just uh, about three nights ago. He surfaced right over here. So not messing around tonight. Got the slug gun with me. You only get six days here to shoot bucks with a firearm. So I'm ready to move on to either freak or ghost. Hopefully they get it. Him. Stay on him. Stay on him. Go get him. Give me some. Oh. Yeah, baby. I think he just went down. I'm gonna peek over at the edge of the woods and just see if he's there. Right there. Kind of celebrate a lot, anything positive in 2020. And this deer is worth celebrating. It was about eight days ago, we were plodding around in here looking for ghosts, thinking I literally ruined the entire season, scaring away a good deer walking through the timber, scaring everything off. And Ghost is alive, 
and Freak showed up tonight and he got it. It's right up here. Oh my goodness. This is the first deer my entire life I've ever been nervous coming up to. Because this thing could absolutely hurt me. Video won't do it justice, but this is an absolute tank of a deer, no matter where you are in the country, let alone Jersey. Unreal. Hey, baby. Oh, look at this. Hey. Daddy, shoot. Shoot. Daddy, shoot. Daddy, shoot the deer. Daddy got the deer. Daddy got the deer. Earth alive. What do you think? Um, don't touch it. <laughs> don't don't touch, touch it? it? You don't have to touch it. You it's don't okay. have to. Daddy will put it back in its mouth. <laughs> I can't see touching. <laughs> well, that's like your new favorite thing. I got you. I got you. Daddy is a deer. You got a deer? Yeah. Is it an old deer? What's his name? Don't touch it. What's his name? Did your dad tell you his name? No. That's Freak. Can you say Freak? 